and welcome back everybody to Desbury Indoor Boards Club for the 2023-24 Ladies Match Play Singles Qualifier and we're down to the last eight. Our featured game is, should be a cracker, we've got Lucy Smith who you might have seen on the stream a little bit earlier. And she's playing Alison Murian, MBA. I'll run through the quarterfinal lineup for you in a second. In fact, I'll do it now while they're just finishing off this second trial end. We've got Sean Honours taking on Annie Dunham. And Bernard is taking on Kylie Jenkins. And Gillian Hinsley is taking on Lauren Gowan. Remember, it is uh, it's a bit of a Brucey bonus because they only have to win this and the semi-final to get the golden ticket down to Potters. Which comes all inclusive into the mixed pairs as well. We top off the draw players with Paul Foster, which I'll... Uh, I'll find out who's top of the draw. In a moment, I'll tell you in a second. Uh, the top of the draw will be the winner of this section. So it's uh, to do Lucy Smith, Alison Mirren, Gillian Hinsley, and Lauren Gowan. So the, one of them four will be playing alongside Paul Foster at Potters. Let's get his on the right camera here. There you go. I'm joined in the box by the best set of uh, Venetian blinds that we've had today. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Johnny Henson, you, you've had my life bloody hitting the record button. You've stood in that front of that camera that many times today. I'll let you off, though. Good afternoon, everyone. I'll let you go. I'll let you go. It could be because there wasn't a great deal to see. No, even Martin Sale was saying, Can you not tell Gillian to move, uh, Jackie to move? I says, Yeah, you're a bit braver man than me. Mm. Molly was um, gesticulating. He'd give, give you the eyes a couple of times, but. <laughs> You were you were in the zone. That's all I can. Oh, I was in the zone. I was in the hot zone. It is so hot out there today. It, it is. So what well, I, I said when, because we've with Emily being on commentary as well, I said to <coughs> us, is, is, uh, "Is it just me? I'm, I'm flush." She said, oh, "It is getting warm, like." It's very hot out there. It, uncomfortably hot. Was it? Mm. Just need the aircon on. Yeah, a little bit maybe. So you'd be a little bit disappointed, I think, will you? A little, yeah. bit of a, a little bit of a chance for all. Happy with the first set. Yeah. Um, wasn't really comfortable in the second set, no. to be fair. I think it was probably more Annie's first ball. I think yeah. her first two balls just how done you was, to be fair. Yeah, she was, she was in the hedge very close. Very experienced player. Oh, gosh. I mean, she's yeah. Without a doubt. But it's all on that learning curve, isn't it? It definitely is. So, our featured game, our featured quarter final is it's a streaming W for Alison Marion. And she's playing Lucy Smith, who's been on the streaming earlier on today. Have you got any um, Mystic Meg predictions for this game or? I've kept clear of this one. You're on the fence. Yeah, I have I have actually earmarked somebody to qualify. Mm -hmm. 
and it might be a bit of an outsider. I've, I've tipped Anne Bernard to qualify. She's a tough bowler. Gosh, she's a good really single tough. under. Yeah. If you if you ever watch this back, and I apologise if you get turned over. When I was playing this morning, I saw a firing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, I heard it first, then. <laughs> yeah, it was like... I'm <laughs> <laughs> just trying to uh, rearrange these cameras that I had to try to rearrange to get a view of you again. <laughs> <laughs> At least you were recording, or was it? Oh, I definitely recorded. You pushed yeah, record, did you? I did push yeah. record. record yeah. Uh, yeah, definitely pushed record for you. Yeah, well played, Lucy. Might have just sat out, might be only a couple. Two out. Ah, an umpire. No, I think when you when you watch when you watch it back, which no doubt you probably will watch it back. Um, you'll, you'll see there was probably a couple of shots that you might have played different, but otherwise I thought you you did all right. Yeah, I now, think there was nothing, a couple nothing of... Be, not, now to beat yourself up about. No, a couple of questionable decisions on some of the shots, but yeah. Nothing to beat yourself up I had I had this person in my, my left ear saying, what on earth is she bowling that hand for? <laughs> I mean, you played a good conversion <laughs> shot. I did. It went yeah. sprung out the side. Yeah. Uh, I know I have uh, Annie drew the shot only just. Mm. Yeah, it was close. So good start for Lucy there. Three on the board. You know, things run to form, the mat will be up the wicket. Stepped outside for a breath of fresh air before my game, and it was beautiful. It's like a summer's day. I'm just sitting there looking, you can see the sunshine at the far side. I said to Emily, I said, We should be playing this outdoors. Mm -hmm. It's got to be at least 18, 19 degrees out there. Probably even a bit more. Next week in the south of France, you're probably looking at 25, oh. 26 degrees. Oh, I'm not knowing myself. <laughs> Bring your suntan lotion next week, yeah, won't you? I still have my jumper on. <laughs> my second yeah. skin, the jumper. In fact, the missus says she's going to bury you in a jumper. <laughs> <laughs> Even if I'm not dead. <laughs> I'll bury you. <laughs> Is that your attire for work as well? Jumper? No. no, no, no. Shirt and tie? IBM, no. IBM uh, polo shirt. Oh, okay. No. Mm, and scraggy nice. jeans. They don't, they don't know. They're Smart casual. They're not much else. Scruffy casual. <laughs> Scruffy casual. Are you all techie, geeky people where you are? Have you got no, finance I, and stuff? No, no, I just... We had got an office, work out of... In the shed? Pick parts up, yeah. Like part of a wagon. We ain't got, we ain't got electricity up north. Do you oh. Don't know? oh, so you're driving around a lot? Yeah, I drive the car, yeah. Just go fix... Oh. Go fix laptops, Lenovo. Oh, okay. My work one's HP. Mm. Oh, well done, Julian. Sorry, just looking on rink seven there. Well done, the Pierce Lucy. I think you've left it. Can we call Alison a veteran of uh, Potters because she's been down a few times, hasn't she? I think you can call her a veteran. Or of, of, of Potters. Yeah, of Potters, yeah, yeah definitely. Come and punch your face if you call her a vet. <laughs> yeah, well played. That's a good ball. I 
think you're just over the top, Lucy. So I think your good start's just going to get wiped out here. Could be a full house, this one. Alison's had a good run so far, hasn't she? She's done well. Some good games. Expect to be a four here. Yeah, well played. So... Loss of three on the first end. What's the way to bounce back? You get a four. Just add some nice quiche. Did you? Mm, baby new potatoes and side salad for my lunch. You might just come off. You must have woofed that down. <laughs> Starving, man. <laughs> Not them four. <laughs> Did you put the knife and fork in water? <laughs> I bet you sparks flying. <laughs> oh, dear. You're like a robot. Hunger. <laughs> yeah. Hunger. <laughs> Somebody coming up to talk to you, God. I've got time, mate. I've got time. Can I take a breath? Got to get, got to, got to, got to, got to get finished. You have a sweet and all. Not today, no. Not today. No, not today. Yeah, well played, loose. E. Oh, can't lose yet. Can't run for a car. Loose. Loose. E. <laughs> she might like that actually. Loose. Probably e. make her giggle. Just in case her mum and dad's watching. <laughs> Debbie's just said to me, is there going to be any banter on uh, private detectives and, you know. Went to the house. Yeah. Was I said, no, we're going to be sensible this our, afternoon. It was our good hour last night when it was. I uh, can't believe she left here and went home and then switched on to watch the bowls. Did you? Well, she I said she loved it. Just in case we rifled the place, did it our? <laughs> <laughs> Keeping an eye on you on camera. Comms cabinet, in case I, I whipped the comms cabinet and stuck at the back of my car. That was the real reason. <laughs> yeah. Michael Keenan's calling you the wolf. The wolf? The wolf. What does that mean? The wolf. You wolf it down. Oh, wolf. Or well, wolf. It, well, it's the wolf, but I call you the wolf. It's a strange thing to say, Michael. <laughs> You're a beast. <laughs> oh dear. The only thing, have, you, have you ever seen a program called Only Connect? And uh, Victoria oh, Court on a Monday. Yeah. The only thing that I get right is when they go, I'll have the line in. And do you know what I do? I go, rah. <laughs> it's, a, it's a good, good it's program. It's, it's, it's That's a big challenge. Oh, it is. If I get one right, I'm over the moon. The only thing I get right is the time it's on. <laughs> they are obscure, though. Some of the questions are very uh, obscure. Well, some of the clues are obscure. Of course I do. However, the more you watch it, the more you take part, the more you learn. You do. You yep. do. Donald, Gillian is playing Welsh International, Lauren Gowan. Mm. We've had two solids already and we're only about five minutes into the game. I'll keep you up to date on the scores on all the other games. Looks like Lucy's... Uh Maybe holding three, two or three out there. Alison's taking two out. I'll tell three. you what, it's like a 2020 cricket game, this, isn't it? Three one end, four the other, three the three. next. God, dear me, how are folks? Well done, Lucy. E. Lucy? I met Lauren Gowan last year at Huntingdon, played yeah. against her, yeah. Nice lady from Wales. Yeah, good, good to see her here. It's interesting how many more ladies are starting to travel to get to some of these events. Yeah, you, you, well... 
I think you've, you've still got two halves of your country, haven't you? You've still got the, the Scottish probably don't come this far down and no. these don't go that far up. No. So I did recommend to Jason, though, but maybe next year we can have something a bit more... A bit more in the middle? A bit more in the middle, yeah. But then you certainly say, well, people travel in the middle. Good reply from Alison. Just a reminder that um, that's a good reply from way. Lucy here. Oh. <laughs> Just a reminder that um, there'll be no final. Just gets played to the two semi finals, and the winners of the semi finals get the golden tickets to Potters. I'm not sure has Lucy ever qualified for Potters. I don't think she's qualified. I'm sure with somebody, if Neil, if you're watching, <laughs> just drop us a message there, mate. Just kicking about here. Good effort. I think Lucy's mum and dad will be over the moon. What if she qualified? Well, if she was mm. yeah. yeah. Over the moon, round the sun, up in the stars. Yeah. Yeah. I've seen Neil in tears a few times when uh, yeah. they won. Yeah. When they won at Limington, the sisters. I mean, I said in the previous... One of the previous streams, the, the family did a lot for the OSC, got it a, a hell of a lot of a commitment, which yeah. is probably the same as a little bit, well, probably the same as what Jason's doing, to be honest, even yeah. on a par, you know. It's yeah. And you can see the toll it takes on you in terms oh of the can. time and commitment to it. But it's amazing what just a handful of people can actually do yeah. for these great events across the whole country. Well, it originally went Pete Tong, didn't it? It was all went wrong with the, <laughs> the dreamy World Bowl Series bollocksy thing, wasn't it? Mm. I mean, who? Go oh, see, Lucy, can you get down? I just can't, I get the wrong side of it. I think in this game, Richie, you, you have to be transparent. Oh, God. I, I think you have to be... Anything financially, you've correct. got to be whiter yeah. than white. Correct. Um, and it has to be crystal clear. And people need to understand it. And I think in bowls, we're not particularly good at this, but communication is key. Yeah, yeah. You need to let people know what's happening when it's happening.
Dann haben wir schon. Actually holding one there. A bit of a boring end, that's only one. Yeah, only one instead oh. of the four. Three and a four, so I have a fox. <laughs> so, six, five. Going into N5. Stand by your beds. Oh, piece of gaffer coming in. Yeah, uh, kill me, Mike. If you want to know who the gaffer was, it's uh, Alan Thornhill. Looking very official. Top man, mate. Yeah. Spoil me now. Oh. Good start from Alison there. Lucy's got a good reply. I'll not do what I did when uh, I've got some secret information that uh, Glasgow would eat a bit paper. Because it's actually an air four sheet of paper and that I have probably chalk on it. So I'll, I'll am I not allowed to read that? No, you can have it. You can <coughs> read that. Yeah. You, you can be the efficient announcer. Oh. That's for the next oh that's for the next one. You can do it for the next one. Need to run loose, see? Right, we've got a question. Why is it only to the semi-finals? It's only to the set the winners of the semi-finals because the PBA made the cracking decision to give an extra four places to the qualifiers. So there was two winning semi-finalists up in Arbroath and two winning semi-finalists from this event all get the golden tickets down to Potters. And they also get an entry into the mixed pairs where they will be paired with their top 16 seed. And the winners of this event today will play with Paul Foster and... Yep. Uh, we'll play, play Julie Forrest in the ladies' world match play. Yep, that's winner of semi-final one. one. And uh, they'll play with Paul Foster, MBE, in the mixed pairs against Mark Dawes and... Julia Gallo, yeah. yeah, and the winner of semi final two on ring six plays Catherine Rednor in the ladies' world and uh, will play with David Gooley MBE in the mixed pairs against Stuart Anderson and Kerry Ann Glenn. So that, that's the reason. So that's for the next round because we're just at the quarters at the minute. So the the ladies have to win this round and the next one. Well, Alison, I'm going to push at this ball there. She's not a million miles away. Oh, I think she's played a cough top here, mind you. Close. If she push and stop, oh, yeah, well, she's laid. Great ball. Same shot from Lucy. Yeah, she might follow her down or have a look down the other side.
So, Lucy, two or three down here, maybe. Don't know how close that far red ball is. Yeah, I mean, from here it looks like three, but as you say, you can't tell the angle of Richie's cameras. That's just the way I'm sitting. <laughs> oh, Lucy. Just going to get the wrong side of it. Oh. Well, that might have saved one. I'll put looking at that angle there. Well, I think that one's not in. I think that could be three. Yeah, three it was. Normal service resumed. Eight six after five ends to Allison against Lucy. <laughs> Are you laughing at? I'm laughing because you said Lucy. See him Lucy. 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 I did threaten to do my monkey dance for Lucy this morning. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't I'll got round to it yet, but I'll teach you. <laughs> Yeah, great stuff from Alison. You might be able to just make out on the big board there the scores. Uh, yep. Annie Durham 3 1 up after 4. Kylie Jenkins 3 2 up after 5. And Lauren Gowan has took the first set yep. against uh, Gillian Hinsley. Double sharp time that was. I think Gillian then needs to reset for this yeah, second start set. again, that's yeah. right. We've, we've said it many times when she's been commentating. It's easy, it's only you, you wipe the first set away. I think I could do with a little headset when I'm on the green. It says, Jacqueline, can you reset after yeah, the first set? No, no, what you need is, Jacqueline, get out the way my cameras. Yeah. Go to the left, go to the right, do the stand in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> you watch it back, you can oh, I don't believe it. Duh. Sorry, I apologise. Well, Lucy, are you going to get out enough? I just need to get to this back ball here. And, uh, Another good wood from Alison. Actually, line is set lie now. I need to slow down. Got a feeling that's run out. If we go to that angle there. Yeah, three to Allison. Three to Allison, and that'll be the first set. Just looking at the board to make sure I'm right. It's not Lucy's got a first, no, Lucy's got another ball. She has. So has Allison. Ugh. There's only six up there, Rich. Keep up, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you, man? Why are you, man? For one the time. I'm not a bloody jury, I'm a mackam. Peter, the old saying that you've, you've pulled a cough drop means you've pulled a good ball, mate. You've pulled an absolute cough drop here. That's just a northeast term. Is or, it? Or it might be a Richie term, actually. I don't think it's a northeast term. I've never heard it. Have you? You hear some uh, funny ones off here. DSS. Yeah. If you wide, high, wide, and handsome, and you get a wink, grab off a ball. You need a bit DSS here. Right. Okay. <laughs> uh, 
It's like Richie was telling me the other day, he was lathered. Lathered. And, uh, I thought it was he was drunk. <laughs> <laughs> but that's leathered. Oh, leathered. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. I thought leathered is if you give somebody a scudden. A scudden? What, a slap? <laughs> a good old... What, with the good belt? Good old slap and With the belt, yeah. So I'll see you, Lucy. I think, yeah. Uh, Oh, she's taken a she couple sits. out. She had the set. So Nick. half each. No, it's going to the end to go. Oh, yeah, it's oh, only six ends. Yeah, six ends. <laughs> Too sheer, what a bee. Anyway, I put the question out this morning. Mm -hmm. It was a vital, important question. Red sauce or brown sauce or no sauce on a bacon sandwich? Oh, it's got to be brown. Got to be brown? Yeah. Controversial. Yeah. Mally, uh, Mally has red. Mally, I have red. Yeah. Red with margarine or something, some accompaniment? Mm, nothing. Nothing. No, dry nothing. dry cob, dry dry bread. Of course, commando. Unless you, you toast it. Uh. And if you toast it, it's got to be butter. It's got to be butter. Yeah, real butter. Real lurpak. Not this fake. It, I think it's butter, but it's not. <laughs> other, other crap butters available. <laughs> Although I should say other butters are available on the market. <laughs> like these silly, utterly butterly utterly things. Butterly. Yeah, a load of rubbish. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be in prison now. <laughs> You'll be set, set out. Uh, you. Anybody that works for Utterly Butterly, we <laughs> do apologise. <laughs> <laughs> it's utterly rubbish. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> We've got the uh, slander cover, you know. Oh. you got your half a million indemnity, haven't you? Insurance. Yeah, but that's from some <laughs> doctor in Nigeria oh. who's promised us two and a half million. Have you had to pay him first? Um, it's apparently it's going into Bolty's account. Oh, I wouldn't surprise me. Uh, that's why well, he's stuck up north. That's right, he's not yeah. in north. He's, he's sitting Hawa in the sun. Hawaii. My beer. Hawaii, man. Hawaii 5 <laughs> man. Oh, not this again. Oh, no, did it go down the cop <laughs> shops? Do, 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 do. do not start. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, like, God, cut your headphones off. All right, I'll be good. Lucy's got good weight. <laughs> just, just agreeing on that. Just need to finish. Just need to beat the two wing balls. There's your chance, Lucy. Are you going to play it with this ball? Or are you going to hang fire? Well, looks like she's going to try to set it up. Well, let's give her a shout. Mm -hmm. Not bad, but I think it's got to run. Mm. Well, it's difficult to get. It is possible to get the four. Just slice the jack out. Yeah, just slice it and mm. uh, hope she hangs around. It's not an easy shot. She's coming up to have a look. Have a look. Well, I should realise that it was the uh, last end, actually. She might Couple of feet over, get the, 
get it thin and get it where the power yard up where the marker is. Going to go, it's I think. Only, yeah, take one out. Mm. Oh, good effort. So, one shot down at St. Murray, which takes the first set 11 6. High score in first set. We'll go to do the quarter finals in two shakes of a lambs. What's it? So on rink two, Sean Honor versus Annie Dunham, uh, three apiece after six ends. Oh, no, it's just changed, just been updated. Yep, first set gone. Mm -hmm. First set's gone to somebody, but we don't know who it is. No. We've got an umpire up there, just making sure the board's correct. It looks like Annie Dunham. Yep. The set first set to Annie Dunham. Again Sean Runner. And on rink three. Um first set or oh, and Anne Bernard? No. No, but it's Sam Bernard, isn't it? Yes, yeah, yeah it's Kylie, Kylie Jenkins. Yeah, so first, first set to Kylie. Yep. Sam Bernard. And the game in front of us, Lauren Gowan, is actually on fire here at the minute. She is. She's won the first set, and she's 7 nil up in the second set after two ends. And it's Gillian Hinsley. Looks like the start of the second set for Lucy is uh, possibly another high scoring end. Yep, I want to drop in for three. Martin Gale being controversial here, mind you, Jacqueline. He's, he's come back with the red sauce, brown sauce, or not, no sauce at all. Mm -hmm. He said red sauce on a bacon bap, brown sauce on a sausage. Bomb cake. What's a bomb cake? Is that? Whoa. Well, got the covered, got the spot covered. That's a good shot from Arson. A bomb. Bomb cake. What, what is that anyway? Must be some Lanc Lancastrianism. Has it got currants in it? Bomb cake, would think, wouldn't you? We okay. have stotty cakes up, up north. Stotty? Stotty cakes. Lovely they are. What like are they made from? Bread, flat bread it is. Like a f lovely. Grilled or fried? I'll fetch you a couple down next week. Yeah. Do you fry them? No, it's bread. Oh, just bread? It's just bread, yeah. I'll fetch you a couple down next week. All right, okay. So what do you do with it? You toast it or do you no, put butter on just it? Just cut it in half, put butter in, bacon in, don't you like? It's just, it's just like a bread, like a bread bun type of thing, but it's a stock, it's really lovely. Sounds nice. When I was up in our broth uh, last week, I brought back some scotch pies. Yeah? Yeah, they were horrible. <laughs> 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 They're not like I remember as a not kid. Like <laughs> They've taken all the good stuff out, I think. <laughs> well, I don't know whether Alison sneaked in for two or not. 
can't really tell from the animal. It yeah. looks I like she two, has. doesn't it? Yeah. So from the head, looking good for Lucy. One ball from Alison. Oh, a good ball there from Gillian. Apparently, I've got two answers here. What a bomb cake is. Mm -hmm. Got any currents in? A bomb cake is a large, flat, flowery roll from the northwest. Okay. So it's like a bap, plain bap. Yeah. A roll, a bap. Martin, bomb Martin's cake. added on the end of his question. His answer traditionally uh, leavened <laughs> with balm. The only balm I know is you put. After shave, okay. you had a shave. It's got to taste very nice, eh? Have you had a shave today? I have. I've had, you know, I've had two shaves this weekend. <laughs> I had a close shave when you two were sitting <laughs> next to us on Brigham Mike. <laughs> <laughs> somebody had the nerve. Somebody had the nerve to say <laughs> today. <laughs> you two co commentators last night were better than two we had at Hartlepool. That was me and Bolty. <laughs> Mortified, abandon them, obviously, straight away, you bard. Bard. Get out, get out my pub. Oh, dear. <laughs> ah, that's good. I think what's really good feedback, Richie, regardless, is that I think there's quite a lot of people listening that like the intermittent Pe banter, yeah, it, the funny bits. Yes. Like I say, if people didn't like it, just switch off. <laughs> you're between with me. Especially he'd, if you he'd had the sound on, you sound off. Couldn't care. Especially if Couldn't you weren't for utterly butterly. Utterly <laughs> anybody here. <laughs> just handed the, the notice in. It's got to be butter. Gillian's just picked up three there. She just needs to possibly rest that ball, mm -hmm. get close to her own. It looks like she's holding, isn't she? Lucy? I don't know, it's very close. Mm. This, this might decide it, eh? Yeah, well done, Lucy. Switch onto that camera yeah. there. It's uh, probably well, two now. Well played. Has a balm cake got lots of flour on it, like it's covered in a white flour or something? It, it, well, he, he, he's, a, he's a latest update on the balm cake mm -hmm. information. Um, if you come to Wigan, you can have a bin lid, the largest balm cake on the market. There you go. So A bin lid? A wow. bin lid. Crikey. What are you going to fill it with? A lot of bacon. A lot of bacon. Sounds nice. I guess it's for sharing then, if it's the size of a bin lid. Sharing? Don't do sharing. <laughs> Don't do sharing. Get off. <laughs> get off <laughs> me food. Oh. <laughs> Don't do sharing. You didn't get this size for sharing. <laughs> if I shared, I wouldn't be off the bad hours. <laughs> oh, dear. No wonder Bolty's not here. He wouldn't have got anything to eat. I don't know. Nice. Did you hear the noise in the hotel last night? I thought years two were shocking. God, yeah. I didn't know what you were on to. Uh, I was on the seventh floor. I could hear the two years. 
<laughs> oh, we were trying to work out which room was was causing a problem last night. Yeah. There was a um, bit of a party on a summer one, wasn't it? Well, it was a repeating song, thudding, boom, 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 and then it stopped for like ten seconds, and it start again. It was the same thing for four hours. Two o'clock in the morning, I think at one o'clock, Mally decides to go down to reception and complain. Well, Alison. I thought oh, you were. Oh, she just I thought you yeah. went right through that. Yeah. I said he went down a cut. He said you never heard a thing. You were too busy snoring. <laughs> in fact, it was you that was making the noise. Probably. <laughs> but it was the room next to us. It's a and I was convinced it was the uh, oh the couple down right, the yeah. family that were in the bar last night the, the noisy family yeah with the kiddies yeah. and Lucy could pick up three here She's gone deep. She's got the wrong side of that ball. Mm. I don't know whether it's one or two. It looked like two when she picked the white. Yeah, I'm playing. That's it. close for two then. Are you coming on? Mm. I've got a feeling this is the quarter final next to us is uh yeah, so all and over. Gowan. Yeah, yeah, well played Lauren. So Lauren Gowan wins uh two sets uh, against Gillian Hinsley. Callop is coming out. Uh, and on rink two, um, Annie Dunham is one up against Sean Honor in the first end, second set. After winning the first set. And Bernard is uh, two up against Kylie in the second set after losing the second set. Sorry, the first set. I like the tailor shirts. The nice blue and uh, the red ones oh, yeah, when they came yeah. out. I think they've been out a while, haven't they? Then? Yeah, a lot of people didn't like them. I thought they looked great. I think when you put the shirt on, it's like, I'm on fire. <laughs> I can toss me palm cake. Toss me palm cake in that <laughs> shirt, I'm not hot. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I disagree with red sauce in bacon. You disagree? Yeah, I disagree. It's red sauce. So. Yeah. Winner of this game will play Lauren Gowan, unless I've got it completely wrong again. And the winner of the Sean on Annie Dunham and Bernard and Kylie Jenkins will face off, and that one will be a West televised semi final. Uh, 
And we'll just hit the, uh, the old 200 so you can, you can have a bit dance around the yellow one. There you go. That's to signify we've hit 200 viewers tonight. Yeah, Currently yeah. watching. Excellent. Quarter past four on a Sunday afternoon. What he's doing? Pretty lovely outside, man. Formula One today, isn't it? Is it? Mm, I think so. <laughs> Molly's not happy. Oh, he's not got to watch I it. I bet he's watching it. He's watching on his phone. I don't, oh, did he? He wasn't watching me then. I was. He was intently watching you. Yeah. <laughs> you liar. <laughs> You're on fire. <laughs> well played, Alison. <laughs> So, Lucy having a little dabble down this hand. I don't know whether it comes down. No, it's a bit high, isn't it? Just doesn't, just doesn't get out. So, penalty kick here for Alison, I think. down to Pierce. Yeah, I think she's just about. Well played. Yep. Three to Alison. So five, five, two to Alison, second set after four ends. Scores right, is it? I'm just gonna. Yep. Oh. Okay. Well, Messed up the score. Oh, Lucy must have just gotten the one then. Strange, I don't know if they've messed up the ends there. It's the end's only three, like. Getting a three, yeah. Got a one there, must have got an added. Only so we're showing the fourth end, so I've got a end too many. Long weekend. That must be four ends, mustn't it? Because they're coming back up this way. <coughs> I don't know. Well, she's looked at the bone and she said it's right. We're on our fourth end now. Oh, okay. But wouldn't four be coming back this way? I'm just saying. I don't know. It's Odds and uh, evens. You start off odd, don't you? Down this end. Oh, we started off odd, all right. <laughs> it's because I'm sat next to you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm sh the score doesn't seem to be quite right, I don't think. Well, I just had to look at it, so yeah. we'll see. Two loose balls from Lucy. I'll uh, give you an update on the other scores. Uh, Annie Dunham won the first hit against Sean on it and is now 5 0 up after three ends. Yeah, well played, Alison. And Carly Jenkins is 2-2 uh, to Anne Bernard after three ends. Uh, 
Holly won the first set. You look better here, and you get out of the way. Good reply there from Lucy. Oh, lucky! Well the ball just caught the seam, I think. A good line, and she fancies it. She's very close here. Eh? Oh, oh. <laughs> just fell the wrong way. Well, that was unlucky. She might have just mm. widened the head out for Lucy Mira. I shot a little bit easier. She could do with turning her own ball over, couldn't she? Yeah, split on top side of uh, her own ball. Mm. Go with it. Lift the two of them out. So she's going for and she's on a decent wicket as well. She's very close here. If she can get the top side of our own ball, she's played this. Well done, Lucy. And follow through for two. Well played. Great stuff. We've got to end five, and it's f five three to Allison, who took the first set eleven six. Oh, we're going to hit the road after this, G. Hmm? We're going to hit the road, Jack. Well, not watch the semi-finals. I might do. Well, I can watch it while Molly's driving. Yeah, you can. You can hit the road. You can hit the road. I'll tell him what the score is. <laughs> Good reply there from Alison. I think Lucy's still just holding. So rink two, Annie Donner is uh, six nil up against Sean Honor in the second set after four ends. So 
She needs to get down. I think Alison's just gone under the head there. Well, it's a bit of a chance for you, Lucy. It's just tip Alison's ball out. Tip the ball out. For might, four. might pick the white at the same time. It's yellow. 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 Pearl. Yellow. Yellow. Hello. Then going down the telly to his rooms. <laughs> la la. Well, I was la la because the kids used <laughs> to love us. Did. Oh god, aye. That's definitely that's why I'm dipsy. <laughs> <laughs> need to hang on here, Lucy. Just Ooh. need to hang on. Can you get anything of us? Oh, it's oh. unlucky. Unlucky. Half a pound more. Mm. Now, Alison, what do you do? Five three up. She could play the same shot on the other hand and just tip Lucy's out for two. Is it two? The danger is to thin <coughs> the white. Yeah. She's got to play something like that. I think she might go a little bit quicker, quicker, but mm. I think she'll try to draw up to the green ball. You think so? Yeah, I think. Game management, you know, Davy Boats, game management, PH 55. <laughs> Appendix three. I need to learn that one. <laughs> yep, just looking to catch that green ball. Don't know whether she's up enough. No, she one thing under. she's up enough. Well, she'll take that one, I think. So, five, four... Off to six ends. Is that five ends? Uh, five ends. Did five. We're, we're going yeah. to the six that was scoreboard. Yeah, I'll show five ends. Uh, just a quick uh, catch up to see where we are. There we go. So we're at Desborough today. Next week we're at uh, Dolphin. Down here again. And then we're up at Glasgow, West Lothian, November. And we finish off at west of Scotland. Just give you a little bit of idea. Get off. Mark your cards. Have you ever tried being a bingo caller? <laughs> Didn't start that. <laughs> Got our bingo numbers at this time of night. We'll be on our night, man. So big end here. Mm. Lucy can sneak a one. No, I don't think so. Well, just need to make the trip.
She's a bit wider with this one. Might just go through. Oh no. No, I think she's got shot like that. Lucy can just tip it out. Almost a repeat of the last end, yeah. See, I'm kind of shot. Mm. Oh, She's gone, gone quick. quick. Gone really quick on it. Oh. <laughs> oh, lucky. I was surprised she went that quick at it. I don't know if I'd have played that shot. Not as quick. No, I'd have looked to take Alison's. Not as quick, because if she got the ball, ball out. fat, she was lifting her own balls out anyway. Pull the white back to the T, to the T. You, you, you were looking at four, and uh, but that's why I asked it there. I'm not playing in the ladies' match play. <laughs> What do you think to the standard of bowling this year then, Richie? Been good, been good, yeah. It's been good. I mean, I was, I'm always impressed yeah. with the women's games. There's so some high-class bowling yeah. this yeah. year. I know I did dob me selling with when uh, Emily was on and I did fetch up the... Oh, it's a man's shot. <laughs> it's playing a man's game. <laughs> I dropped myself in it. But There's something to be said, though, about playing the man's game, and I know what you mean by that. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, I've played w in ladies' leagues and I've played in mixed leagues, and I think in the mixed leagues, playing with the fellas... You actually learn a lot more than you would by just playing in the ladies' leagues. Yeah, without a doubt. That's no disrespect to the ladies' game. It's just no. I mean, it has come on, like I said to Emily, I said it's come on leaps and bounds. Because people are, oh, I'll, I'll try that shot myself. I'll, I'll have a rive at it. I'll mm. have a, you know. I think there's more confidence, I think, in some of the men's games. Well, it's like Davey said on one of our podcasts, he said... He, in the olden days, the women would be six down within a foot and they'd be trying to draw a second. Yeah, yeah. But I think the the shot selection of the ladies' games is, is, is improved dra absolutely dramatic, dramatically. A lot more aggressive. Well, need a three, Lucy. I think you're one down. Uh, late score in the other two games. Uh, Annie Durham is 6 1 up, going into win six against Sean. And Kylie Jenkins is 5-3 up going into win 7 against Anne Bernard. And she just drew a stutcher. And Anne's on her last ball, so that could be all over in a minute. Oh, that's unfair. She got a result there. Yep. Uh, well done, Kylie Jenkins. Oh, she gets books up place. That's my tip out. <laughs> the kiss of death.
Well, go and have to play a worldly A, Lucy, just to give yourself a chance. Any results on Top Club yet? Well, Mr. Butt is here. He hasn't come. He's never been on. Probably having to lie down. <laughs> you kip. Hmm? All right. They won. Well, can you get down? Very. You're in the area, Lucy. Oh, you're very close. She here. is. You're she's here. trying, she yeah. Clear your past the Oh, oh no. she's Oh, unlucky. It's made that really difficult. I think she possibly might have been knocking a pound. Mm. Another pound in weight probably held her on. Our third semi finalist is Annie Dunham. She's beaten Sean on that. Straight sets. Well, it's going to do well to get a three out of this. Well, Lucy, I can honestly see you getting a three out of this job. It's going to be hard. If anybody can see a shot, I can't see a shot. I think it's one of these you just uh, whistle down the wind and hope for the best. Mm. Apparently, th Walty did win. He did, yeah. Yeah. Julian's just. He'll be having to lie down. He's still having to lie down. Is that because he's not Yeah, there we go. I thought as much. Oh, she bounced oh. it back up, but her three balls went left, east, north, south and west. So, well done, Ali St. Murray, and she's in the semi-final. Uh, as always, thanks for your support. The final, uh, the two semi-finals... A round of applause there. <laughs> Dancing around the keyboards. Uh, the two semi-finals will be on in around about five, ten minutes. We'll give them a quick break. As always, this has been a wrong bias production. Thanks again for your support. Back in ten minutes.